Kia ora, we're back at the pa, and as you can see, the turtles look like they're dying. Now these are leaves that I pulled off in the previous months. That one looks like it's dying. Looks like it's dying. Looks like it's dying. Looks like they're dying. Looks like more dead plants. More dead plants. Dying. 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 What if I told you they weren't dying? What if I told you that they were just getting ready for the winter? Because that's the case. Um, the only way that a tuttle can grow in cold climate throughout the winter is if you put it in one of those. But the greenhouse is full. So other alternatives include things like frost cloth, frost tunnels, plant loops, etc, etc. Um, but these ones we will leave to go through one. and then in the spring they'll come up so we'll expect those to be shooting up again all nice and strong after Matariki probably sometime in December but again we thank the uh, Mara trustees for the opportunity to plant um, you see there's some cabbages and stuff there so the garden will be uh, We'll be prepping it for the winter, probably going to plant some things like some cabbages um, and some other leafy greens, probably some broccoli. Um, I had a trial run of broccoli at the house and uh, managed to get some good kai out of our broccoli harvest. But yes, taros never die whānau. Never, never, never.